It's amazing to me what stories get attention in the mainstream media. Remember the Save the Whales slogan? Well now the entire planet is going insane over a dentist shooting Cecil the Lion. On Jimmy Kimmel Live, Kimmel had plenty to say about this and was not at a loss for words concerning his feelings for the dentist. This guy must have quite a collection of animal heads because, uh, well, here he is posing next to a bear he shot. This is another lion he killed in 2008. This is a leopard. This is a rhino. He killed like half of Noah's Ark. And <laughs> maybe we can show the world that not all Americans are like this jackal here, this dentist. The top I couldn't find any sound bites of Kimmel talking about the evils of Planned Parenthood murdering children and dissecting them for profit, but somebody shoot Cecil the Lion and he has plenty to say. And not just him, the left has apparently lost their collective mind over this. All that's missing is President Obama saying that if he had a lion it would look like Cecil. In other news, NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell upheld his original decision to suspend quarterback Tom Brady for four games, citing that Brady had destroyed his cell phone. This serves as another example of misplaced priorities. Where is the punishment for Hillary? She destroyed evidence too, only she did it while under subpoena to turn that evidence over to Congress, evidence that was the property of the American people. Under Hillary, four Americans were left to die in Benghazi. Brady let a little air out of a football. He's been punished, and his punishment sticks, but not Hillary. Why does the rule of law not apply when the situation is one of far greater importance? And why does the left pile on to the little things? And the Republicans are no better. Americans demonstrated across the country in solidarity against Planned Parenthood. You would think the mandate is clear, but the House of Representatives left for summer recess without even voting on whether or not to defund Planned Parenthood. I feel like the priorities of the whole world are upside down. After seeing the difference in how the left responded to Planned Parenthood being exposed and the shooting of Cecil the Lion, I'm reminded of Isaiah 520. Woe unto them that call evil good, and good evil. Thanks for listening. Don't forget to subscribe and donate at the Show.com.